Okay, now we will discuss about the median of group data. So we will use the same table. So because we are going to group the data, so we just use the same table to avoid uh, making this video longer because um, we will be going also in getting the frequency distribution table. So we will have the frequency distribution table. So the formula for the median of um, group data is given by L plus N over 2 minus CF uh, less than over the frequency of the interval class times the uh, size of the interval. So we have that one as IS. Okay? So your L is the lower limit of the interval class your n over 2 or so that is n over 2 so that is the middle of the half of your half of the half of the number of data or your n then your fi that will be the frequency of your interval uh, median class okay your cf less than is the cumulative or the cf so cf less than of the class one step below the median class okay. and your is so i sub s is the sum sum not, not the sum but the size sorry for that Okay, so the size of the interval. Okay. Really, this is... Okay, so we will use that formula in, get, in getting the median for our given table, or for our given frequency distribution table. So basically our group data so we just first get the frequency so the cf less than I just drop my pen my notepad pen okay so we first get the cf less than so we begin here with this be one 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 two two four this will be 9, this will be 15, 22, 30, 30, 30, 35, 39, 46, and 50. Now we will get the median class. So the median class could be get by first solving the n over 2. So our n is 50. So 50 over 2, that will be 25. So we need to find the CF less than that is above this one or CF so it's just above this one. So median class is the, in the class interval which cf less than is a step higher than n over step higher than n over 2 okay so that is our median class so our n over 2 is 25 so we need to find the class interval of which cf cf less than is a step 
So only one step higher than n over 2. So going back to our CF, so 22 is not a step higher than 25. So the step higher than 25 is, is 1, 30. And this and 30, the class interval that corresponds to 30 is our median class. So this whole is just uh, this one. This whole is our median class, including all of these. Okay, so we now have our median class. So we could now have our L, which is the lower limit of the interval class. So that is an interval class, but the median. Sorry for that the lower limit of the median class so our median class is this one so our lower our lower limit is um, l so our l so let's just put l below here so our l so the lower real limit that will be 67.5 okay so it will be 67.5 then next we will have our Fi, so the frequency of the median class, so that will be this one, F, so that is the F, okay, so that will be 8, so our Fi is equal to 8, then our Cf less than, so the Cf less than is the Cf less than of the class as one step below the median class, so the Cf less than of the class one step below the median class. So this is our median class, the CFR median class. So the the CF less than a step below this one is this one, 22. So we, our CF less than is 22 and our size of the interval is 7. Now we could solve for our median. So we just substitute everything, okay? So this is L, N over 2 minus CF less than over FI times our IS. Okay, so we have X bar. So this, our L is 67.5 plus our N over 2 is 25 minus 22 over 8 times size of the interval is 7 okay, so if you are going to use our calculator okay so we have 67.5 plus 25 minus 22 over 8 times 7 and this will be equal to 70.125 okay, our median is equal to 70.125 and that is now our answer so that is how you are going to get the median of a group data okay so if thank you for watching this video and as always keep on studying